How to fix sound not working on your LG monitor. Okay, first things first, before I go ahead and show you the settings, go ahead and ensure that your connections are secure. Okay, so let me show you. This is your, let me open this up in a new tab and show you properly. So what's going on right here? This is the HDMI cable, and this is the DisplayPort cable. You usually will have connected using one of these. Okay, because these support also, you know, visual plus audio transmission. Okay, and if you're using external speakers, you want to make sure the audio cable is securely plugged in to the audio port on the monitor. Now, next, what you want to do is you want to go ahead and set the OG monitor as the default audio device. So on your PC, you should see your speaker icon right here. What you want to do is right click on this and then come here. Now that disappeared. Let me bring it back here. So right click on this, click on open sound settings. Okay. And I'm going to show you what exactly you need to do right here once this loads up. So you see here it says choose your output device. You want to go ahead and locate your LG monitor in this list and you want to click set as default device. You want to set this as the default one, okay? And then what you can do is you can go ahead and also adjust your monitor audio settings. So just press the settings button on your monitor to access basically the OSD menu, you know, the on-screen display menu, for example, this one. You just want to navigate to the sound and audio settings section and ensure that the volume is completely turned up and confirm that the monitor speakers are actually enabled, okay? Once you do that, you can go ahead and update your audio drivers if it still doesn't work. So on your PC, right click on start, click on a device manager, and I'm gonna show you exactly what settings we are going to be tweaking. So we are basically gonna be updating our audio drivers. So let this load up first. Let's go ahead and wait for this to load up. So you wanna find your audio driver. So here we have audio input outputs, right click on your audio uh, driver for the monitor okay and click on for example update driver and if prompted what you want to do is click on search automatically for updated drivers uh, software and then go ahead and install that okay and if that still doesn't work what you can do is you can go ahead and test it with different content different devices try connecting it to a different device see if it works maybe a laptop a gaming console to see where the problem actually lies. Is it the monitor or is it your PC? And then what you can do is you can check for system updates. So right click on start, click on settings. So we're gonna be checking for any updates. So because if we are not updated, click on update and security. So if we're not updated to the latest version, you could have compatibility issues. So if you see an update right here that is available, go ahead and click on update and install that. And also as a last resort, what you can do is Go ahead and access the uh, OSD menu, and then go ahead and set reset to initial settings. Okay, it's right here at the bottom. Click on this option. Go ahead and reset it to factory default. This can go ahead and help you resolve you know software glitches that may be affecting the sound. And it's really that easy and simple, guys. So I hope this guide provided value to you. And if it did, consider smashing that like button as well as subscribing to find a solution. And I'll see you guys in the next one.